Let's see. Um, I'll drop the hammer. And um, I have new messages. Let's see, it looks like they need armor. I'll see if I can give them some better armor. Um, Palladium's pretty good, I think. What's that? Oh, magic dagger. dagger. So if I can give them better armor, that would be good. I have shroomite. I might be able to give them the shroomite um, board if I have enough bars for it. I don't see the palladium armor. Um, looks like I have a good amount of the shroomite. I'll see if I can give them the um, the digging claws are really good. Um, let's. Oh, maybe I have to do it at the uh, forge. Hmm. The wings are like the best that you can do with the the, the digging claws and the um. Here's the hoverboard. Oh, I need Souls of Flight. I wonder what I need for the digging claws. The dig oh no, something came in my house. Akram is awoken. I hope they're ready for it. Looks like they don't have armor for it. I don't see Akram though. Okay, here we go. I need to use my rainbow gun. It's really good. You can get the rainbow gun from the uh, dungeon. I'm using the Terraria blade right now. My health is getting low. He's getting into his, uh, his attack mode. We defeated them. Awesome. Let me see if I can give them the, uh, the, the board. Oh, Akram again? Okay. It's like we're just destroying Akram. It's awesome. So I have a minion now. I also used, um... The um, golden shower. I'm um, losing health really bad. I need like a ton of health. Shoot, I'm about to die. Bought to use the health potion. Um, oh, we got them. Awesome. Souls of Blight, nice. I need to heal up. I'll see if I can give him the, uh, 
goes uh, the hoverboard. Here we go. Cool, now they have a hoverboard too. So we can kind of like fly around. Um, so I got my uh, pygmy staff activated. Um, not sure what we're gonna do next. I should get one of the uh, Oh, the other person left. I was going to get the mechanical skull and then we could have fought in that. Oh, here's a Mimic right here. So, Akram has a rare chance of dropping um, a couple items that are kind of really rare, just Akram drops. I think he has a mask. He can also drop armor as well. Um, Oh, Wendy came back. Oh, Akram again. Cool. So, Akram is the final boss for the mobile version of Terraria. Um... He's not as hard as some of the other bosses, though. Um, like, I want to say Duke Fishron might even be harder than Akram. Um, because his main attacks is... He lunges at you, his lasers, and... Then he also shoots these little projectiles at you as well. Like, spinning, um... Things... Alright, we defeated them again, that's awesome. So by using the golden shower, you actually reduce his um, defense by, I think, 8? Um, I, I think I'm wrong with the number. I think it's uh, more or less. I'm not sure. But I know golden shower is really good to use on most of the bosses. Oh, awesome. I just got some items. Oh, a Titan helmet and a couple other ones. I don't know if I'm ready to fight him again. Twins have broken. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I'm like already at like half health. Um, we need to move for the twins. I am not ready for this. Twins normally kill me really good.
Yeah, I've only got one thing of health left. Oh, I think, oh shoot, the eye lasers got me. I wonder if Wendy can be able to take out the twins and Ockram at the same time. That would be awesome if she can. Shoot, that just got hurt really good. So Wendy's over here somewhere. I gotta try and get over there to help um, take some of the damage. Oh shoot. Oh, one of the eyes is gone. That's awesome. I don't have anything for regen. Vampire knives are really good for regening your health in a fight like that. I just died again. I can't believe Wendy's surviving. It's a very strong character. in the game. There's Wendy. Oh, the, um, okay. Wait, why can't I pick it up? Oh, it's an Ocram one. Okay. Um, health potions. Oh. Oh, wow. I gotta put some stuff away. So I guess, um, she's got pretty good armor already, um, oh, maybe we should do the, uh, Christmas event, I don't know if she's strong enough for that, though, I'll toss it to her and see if she wants to do it or not. Oops. A band of regeneration? Um, shoot. Don't know if I'm willing to give up the other items I have for the to equip the regeneration though. Um because these other items do like a ton of things. Alright, so let's get another fight going. Um let's do the mechanical skull. He's pretty easy. 
Oh, it's daytime. We can't do it during daytime. Um, we could do um, Plantera. Plantera is pretty easy. I think it's, this is my first time live streaming with another person in my game. Pretty cool. I got a fiery greatsword. Um, trying to figure out what stuff I should have with me and what stuff I should drop. This Titan helmet looks really good. What armor do I have? Yeah, it might be better than what I've got. I'm gonna try it. Add the beetle set active. I'll give this a try for, for now. We could defeat the wall of flesh, that's a pretty easy fight. The only problem is that when you um, dig in a world where there's water, um, it kind of messes with the um, world a little bit. Shoot. I'm having multiplayer and Digging in water isn't very good. Like water like causes like a ton of lag. Let's see, let me go catch up with Wendy. I love the hoverboard. It lets you travel pretty quickly and you can um, kind of control your height a little bit. Well, you know, like hover. Um, sometimes I forgot what I've placed in a chest, so it's like. Um, each time I find a chest again, I gotta try and remember what I put in there. I try and bring most of the chests to the top surface of the world. Um, like when I find one, I try and bring it up. Uh, that way, um, it's easier to get. Oh, okay, well, she went in the dungeon. That's a cool spot. I like going in the dungeon. There's some really good enemies you can find here. The bone leaves are really good. They have a chance of dropping the um, the black belt, and uh, there's like some special boots that they drop. Looks like there's still a lot of chests in here. I don't see any of the special chests. Oh, here's one. 
entrance this one? Oh, it's already open. Ooh, gold, that's always good. Almost looks like I haven't explored this um, dungeon very well. There's no lights placed like all over. I need to set some of those, um... Some of the, uh... Chests I gotta bring back up here. Um... I need to put more stuff in the chest, but I don't know what all to put in. So I'm going to try and grab all the stuff that's in the chest down here. And just bring it up to the surface. And once it's empty, I can grab the chest, too. Um, I'll drop the potion of water walking for the chest. I love how the um, Terra Blade also produces light. It's pretty awesome. I got one chest up. Oh, and I also have keys also here too. I have hollow keys, so if I can find any hollow chest, I can open them. So I just picked up the potion of water walking. Oh, this doesn't look like a hard mode dungeon though. It just looks like a regular dungeon. These aren't like the tougher enemies. Oh, that's a crimson chest here. I don't have a crimson key yet. I don't remember if that's the one that has vampire knives or if it's one of the other ones. Let me check the map on this dungeon. It looks like there's still an area of the dungeon I haven't even explored over here. Yeah, I think I'll need to fight Plantera. To make this a hard mode dungeon. I should drop some stuff in the chest again. Always good to put gold away, um, 
because you don't want to drop it. I don't need souls of flight. I think that's all I can put in there for now. I'll head back over. Oh no, I want to go to the um, to the jungle to fight um, Plantera. See, the jungle is over here. I might not even be strong enough for Plantera. I need a bed. I saw a bed down in the dungeon. I'll go grab that. Cause if you have a bed, and you can spawn um, or set it right near Plantera. You can um, pretty much keep on dying, and um, Plantera won't despawn. I should also set a bed on, on top of the dungeon. That way, I um, we don't have to like keep traveling all this way just to go back to it. Hopefully I can find two beds. One for Plantera and one for the dungeon. Maybe I should cut down some wood. Might be good. We're back at the dungeon. Kind of throwing stuff in the chest to empty out uh, some space. Um, that should be good for now. I'll see if I can get a bed. And I can make this area up here like a, like a house. So we can sleep up on top of the, um, or set a spawn point on top of the dungeon. I think I saw a bed here somewhere. Is that one? Oh, that's a bathtub. Case. Here's here's a bed. I found one. So I'll just need to set uh like something sort of like a house on top of the dungeon. I might need like a table and chairs, so I'll grab these ones. I'll go and head up there now, that way I don't die and have to like travel all the way back. I'll crumbus awoken. Oh no, I gotta travel back up. I'll just teleport. It's probably faster.
Oh, my health is really low again. I'm about to die again. I've only got one health left. Yeah, I died. I wonder what armor they're using. That's they're doing really good. So I guess the beetle armor is not the best armor to have. Even though it takes a lot to up to the beetle armor. I think we defeated Ockram again. Oh no, I think they're still fighting. Yep, Ockram's still around. Or is this a new Ockram? This might be a new one. I've only got three health left. I don't know if I can survive. Yeah, I died. Oh, but we defeated uh, Akram, though. That rainbow gun setting a, a beam like it does is really awesome. It does damage over time. You can get that from a hard mode dungeon. Um, and this guy here, the um, minion that I've spawned there, he's all, I think he's found from Frost Chest in a hard mode dungeon. I need to set my spawn point closer to. Um, the area we're fighting in. I think there's a bed here a little bit closer. So that one's set. I think the best place to set a bed is on the surface. Um, I don't think it's good to set beds down in the um, um, in the underground area. Unless like it's like a Plantera arena. I think that, that one makes sense. Or even the um, Um, the jungle temple. I guess even if you built your Plantera arena near the jungle temple, that would kind of takes care of two of them. I still am trying to get a trophy for for um that I need to fight Akram for and that's uh to get all the armor um there's a lot of armor that Akram will actually drop oh I died again wow I'm not doing so good Sometimes I can survive 
um, for a little while. Maybe I should use that ring of um, regeneration, but not the boots. I'll get rid of the helmet. It does uh, underwater swimming and mobility on ice. I guess I really didn't need that. But yeah, health regeneration is probably a little bit better than breathing underwater. Um, I gotta try and get back over to where uh, Wendy is. I think they're over here somewhere. Oh, here's the jungle area. We should really dig down here. Um, I may have actually actually I already have like ways down um, I just gotta check the map whoa they're fighting Akram right now Akram defeated awesome Oh, an Akram mask? Those are really rare. That's awesome. I need to move around more. I think that's probably part of my problem for not staying alive. Kind of dodging the attacks, I guess. Akram defeated again, that's awesome. Okay, so I gotta figure out how to get the Plantera from here. Um... So it looks like I've already got like a way down sort of by the jungle temple. I think I'll just dig straight down, that would probably be better. Get into the jungle area.
So yeah, if I can set a um a bed down here, we'll be able to, um, to spawn in that area, and that'll be really good. Um, can I set the spawn point? Windy left, I don't know if uh, they're coming back or not. Um, so I'm almost by the jungle temple. I think it'd be good to have the bed near the jungle temple for um, kind of multi-purpose. Because uh, the jungle temple is an area that you'd want to spawn to also. Maybe I already have a, looks like there's a um, jungle shrine, I think, here. Well, I'm actually going to stop it here. Uh, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Have a good day.